Let the good times roll Let the good times roll Don't care whether you're young or old I'll let the good times roll Well, that's a big rat. Got him. Time we got ammo. Not in here. Oh, wait. Elevator. Shh. Be quiet, Vito. Since when are you concerned about making noise? There's too many of them. Just take them out nice and quiet. What do you mean? We've been just gunning them down all this time. I can try, man. Sneak is not really my forte. I think I remember this part weirdly enough. Right, how are we sneaking through here? Oh, 
like my sister. Well, that didn't work. So now let's do it the old fashioned way with the bullet. Ow! supposed to get past them. Come on, take the shot. Hurry up here. I thought there was someone one of these. Rooms. Oh, there's a lot of ammo. Well, at least I know there's ammo in there. Um. So I think if I could throw a grenade in there, it'll be fine. Shh, be quiet, Vito. Since one of you look at his head rattling like that, like Killua's brother. Just take him out, nice and quiet. Just make sure I'm prepared. It wasn't working. I don't know how to do that, man. Sorry. Let's just hope this part works. Um, yeah, I don't know how to do the quiet one. I, I've tried it. I tried it, you just, you guys saw me trying everything, I'm not good at it, so, we're just going as loud as possible. We're going loud so the neighbors can hear it, dude. Got him, hip shot. More of them. I know, Joe. I know. So bad so far, right? 
Yeah, but what if somebody recognizes us and Carlo hears about it? That's why we ain't leaving no witnesses. There's probably Capiche? Get ready. What the hell are you doing? Get in the elevator. I am getting ammunition, bud. Can't just start shooting without ammo, or you're not gonna have any bullets. What is that? Look at that blood right there. You're dead, you slanty eyed fuck! What is it that you want? What the fuck do you think we want? We want to know why you had our friend killed. We also want the money you took from him. Mostly the money, not really the friend. Please. Your friend was a government informer. What, what the fuck are you talking about? A contact inside the Federal Bureau of Narcotics told me that Henry Tomasino passed them information about our deal. That's a fucking lie! Whoa, whoa, whoa. You saying Henry was a rat? Yes. I mean, how long did you guys know him for? But not anymore. That's bullshit. Makes no sense. And I suppose you had nothing to do with the little stick-up after we closed the deal with you either, right? You think we would take such a stupid risk and destroy our own factory? Well, that actually makes a lot of sense. That was just another reason to get rid of you. We had problems with you from the very beginning. Yeah. Well, all your problems are just about over, pal. So where's our money? It's not here anymore. Damn it! Where the hell is it then? I cannot. I want my money. If you don't tell us, I'm gonna splatter your yellow brains all over this fucking room. If I told you, I'd be dead anyway. Fine, your choice. Are you crazy? What you wanna do? Let him go or something? We could have gotten more out of him. Fuck that! He wouldn't have said nothing. These bastards are tough. Let's just get the hell out of here before the cops come. But my money. Also, what's with that blood on the floor? Looks like this place won't be opening up for a while. If we had the time, I'd burn it to the damn ground. Let loading screens. And we're in trouble. Ah, oh, fuck this. Come on, Vito. Let's get out of here. There's too many of them. Find us a car. Quick. This guy's a maniac. We gotta take him down. Time for one. Oh, this is gonna be something. Um, where do I find a car, Joe? We're in front of the cops. Where do I find a car? Huh? Well, this is gonna be fun. Ah, oh, fuck this. Come on, Vito. Let's get out of here. There's too many of them. Find us a car. Quick. Like honestly, where am I gonna find a car in all of this? Unless I shoot the windows. Unless I shoot the windows from the thing, I can't get a car. Let's get out of here. This guy's a maniac. We gotta take him down. The cop car, the cop car, the cop car. Copy that. Oh, that's the best you got. I made myself. Suspect is about six feet tall, dark hair, medium build. Roger that. I've got no more details right now, but stay tuned.
I had to go straight into it. We lost. Take me to my place, Vito. No, I didn't. I need a fucking drink. That was, uh, was fucked up, huh? Yeah. I don't want to talk about it. Just get me back to my place, would you? All right. We just try not to die. Now we can go back to your place after I try not to die. What do you got? An aversion to red light? Dude, we're gonna be chased by cops. What is this, the Indianapolis Speedway? Take it easy. I'm in a rush. Right, dude. We're about to. We're being chased by cops. We need to get out of here as fast as possible. This isn't the time you weren't about the speed limit. Shut up. All right. Looks like we're pretty much fine for the most part. Oh my god. Okay, let's try to find a different way than there. Joe's place. Hey, keep it on the road. No. Special way. It's a special route, dude. It was a total fucking disaster. Tell me about it. Henry's dead. We don't have Bruno's money. We killed half the Toms. And if they think Carlo sent us, that don't mean war. We're fucked. Yeah. And if Carlo finds out we got him into this mess... What if Henry really was a rat? No fucking way. Don't even say that. Look, first let's get the money for Bruno. That'll fix at least one problem. But I'm done for today. I need a drink. Call you in the morning. We'll figure this shit out. All right. Okay, I'll see you later. And Vito, be careful. Chop chop. Alright, are we still in chapter twelve, I think? Thirteen? I think we still might be in chapter thirteen. Chapter fourteen! One more chapter left, I think. That was a pretty quick chapter. Um, let's actually look. Stop running that phone. I'm trying to see how many chapters we have left. We have two more chapters. We're in chapter 14. Don't turn that radio on. Oh, we're still in this shithole apartment. Vito, you ready? Does it sound like I'm ready? You just woke me up. So get the fuck up. We don't get the money for Bruno today. We're fucked. Where the hell are we gonna get our hands on 55 grand, huh? Can I have that 55 grand? I'm sure as hell ain't gonna find the laying around in bed. I got something for starters. A job from Eddie. Bruno's the Jew guy, right? Oh, shit. That we got the money from. In a few minutes. So get dressed, grab a gun, and wait for me outside. Weren't we supposed to have been paid him? Like, how many days has the, has the deal gone on? I, I thought we paid him already. Sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to snap at you. I'm still half asleep over here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So you win or not? Sure, why not? How long till you get here? I'm calling from the gun shop around the corner. I'll be in your place in a minute. All right, I'll wait for you out back. I'll see you soon. Only colas. Place sucks. Oh, about a beer. Where'd you get that car from, bro?
Hey, what's with the fancy wheels? Yeah! Daddy gave it to us just for this job. I said, you drive. My head's still pounding from last night. We're going to Greenfield. Guess you hit the sauce pretty hard, too, huh? Yeah, I couldn't sleep either. Not in a bottle of scotch couldn't fix, though. Hell yeah, dog. Head over to Greenfield. Watch out, dude! Right. So how can you tell me what this is all about? We're just gonna drive there, pop some guy, and drive away. Oh, I know which one this is. Why? Eddie said it's a favor for some family from another city. Unfinished business. He gave me this envelope with all the instructions. Said it's gotta be clean, and it's gotta be done today. I wonder how they're gonna play this in Mafia 1, because of that, that mission where you shoot the guy from Mafia 1. They're afraid that if it ain't done right away, the guy's gonna disappear again. Yeah, here's a picture. What'd this guy do? Says here he ratted his family out to the feds. Guy's got it coming to him now. But wait a minute. If he cooperated with the feds, that means he was under protection, right? What if he still is? Even if he is, we're getting paid a few grand for the job. So it's more than worth the risk. Nah, if you say so. Hey, we need every penny we can get right now, right? So after we finish this job, we'll split up and look for other work. All right. Says here they want us to give him a message before we do it. Here, here it is. Cool. Okay, got it. Hey, if you see Eddie later, not a word about yesterday. He was never there. Last chink we saw was delivering egg food young. You get it? Yeah, what do you think I am? Some kind so we don't know anything about the, um, the guys that got shot over in that Just place. Make sure you don't slip up, that's all. Don't use any slurs, Vito. I'm the only one that gets to use Chinese slurs around here. Don't you go slipping up now. The signs don't actually look remastered now I'm looking at them. The signs don't really look that remastered. I mean, I guess you wouldn't really have to pay attention to them. Yeah, I wonder how they're going to tackle, um, so this is the third time, or no, in August, it will be the third time that this mission is being redone. It was redone in the first game, which Vito wasn't technically in the first game, but they have him killed by it's two hitmen. Um, they have him killed by like, two hitmen, um, that later turns out to be Vito. So, and then this game is, it's kind of like remastered. You get to see that scene again, remastered. But now that Mafia 1 remake is coming out, we're going to see the scene remastered again for the third time. I mean, interesting. I mean, you're going to have to wait until like the end of the game, if I'm right. See that, that scene remastered, but it's pretty cool. You all saw that officer, right? I didn't do anything. You remember what you gotta say? Yeah. All right. Here we go then. Dude, I got this. I'm a pro. A pro. That's a nice house, man. Mr. Angelo? Uh, yes? Mr. Salieri sends his regards. I would actually love to watch this in Mafia 1. To see if it's even Vito's voice actor. Or if it even looks like Joe. Actually, while I'm waiting, I might as well. Like I said, I he's he's so Hold on. Um, should I put the scene up or no? Maybe I will put the scene up to compare it. But let's look up Mafia 2. I'm going to turn the volume down low also. Because I don't really need the volume. I don't really care that much. Mafia 1. Ending. 
Oh, there's actually a comparison thing, but I don't need to see the Playing comparison from thing. George's iPhone. All I need to see is the... Here we go. Okay, there's that car. There's the car. There's a... Nope, yep, so yeah, it was just some random hitman. Mr. Angelo? Yes. Mr. Sun sends his regards. Oh, you know what, he does have, um, this, this guy, the guy in the yellow suit has Joe's kind of fatness. So, they got that part, they, they kind of got that part right, and... It probably was inten it wasn't intentional. Um, let's see what how it sounds. Mr. Angelo. Uh, yes. Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Okay, so it wasn't Vito. I was actually curious about that. And then it's redone in Ma it's basically redone in Mafia Two to link it to Vito and what's one call it? To Vito and Joe that did it. I mean that's pretty cool though. That's pretty cool. I like it. But yeah, I just wanted to see that. I'll probably put it up on there. Maybe I'm best guys over there. Shit. Go, go. Go for it. Let's get the fuck out of here. We got a homicide here. Suspect is armed. This is Suspect your butt I'm armed. We need police right. in Greenfield. Up and down. Up down. Oh. Shoot this asshole. Go fucking down. Copy that. Those were feds. That asshole really was under protection. And he's famous for convenient leaving out little details like that. Maybe he didn't know. Don't matter now. We got a Let me in. No, he probably didn't know. He probably just wanted... It probably didn't matter. Probably like, if you two die, you two die. Who gives a shit? Joe, fucking shoot him. Joe! Joe! What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> fuck, that was close. Get me to Kingston, will you? I got a car waiting there. What about the money? Hey, I almost forgot. Eddie paid me in advance, so here's your share. Nice. Nice three G's. And we have an update to yesterday's shooting at the Red Dragon restaurant in Chinatown. The owner was found dead in his office. The victim of a gunshot wound to the head. Also uncovered. Fuck you, Kappa! I like having like, I like this world because it's not so congested with cars that I have to worry about driving fast. Like, it doesn't really matter. As long as I avoid most of the people, it's fine. Also, turn that off. Don't be up my ass, bro. I know how to. Drive. Yeah, and there's a cop like right there, so what do you want me to do? Man? Literally, there's like a cop car. Good luck getting your hair for the money. Come by my place when you're done. Okay, I'll see you later. Alright, yeah, going to Derek is a pretty good idea. Let's get some new clothes.